everybody, it's Paige. So today's video is going to be my very first project progress video. I am so inspired by Lauren May Beauty. She does these like all the time and I am, ugh, she gets so much progress done on her products. So I was super inspired by her. Credit goes to her for this video idea. I'm not sure if she got the idea from somewhere else, but I got the idea from her, so I wanted to give her credit, and I will leave her channel linked in the description box. I love her channel so much. I've talked about it in the past, but yeah, anyways, um, basically, I have some products that I really want to focus on and work through that are not currently in my 12 pans of Christmas project pan. That's a separate project, which I will leave my intro to that linked in the description box, and I will have my update coming at the beginning of December for that project, so yeah uh let's just get right into it i have a basket full of goodies and basically i'm going to show you everything that i have in this basket where i'm at and then next month i will show you updates i will add new products and take products out if i'm sick and tired of using them or if i finish them or whatever so this is kind of like you know a way to update you and now i have another video that i can film every month so yeah let's just get right into it Alright, so the first product I have is the Paul Mitchell Smoothing Super Skinny Serum. This is a hair serum that you put on after you take a shower. Now, my hair looks super oily, like really easily, so I have to be really careful with this and use only a tiny bit, but I got these like two, if you bought two, you got them for $20 each, probably when I was a freshman in high school, which was like six years ago seven years ago six years ago I don't know I got these a long time ago back when the little feather hair extension thing was a trend when I got that put in at the hair place that's when I bought these so this is my second one I completely used up the first one and I just really want this to be gone but I want to use it up because I spent $40 on it which was a lot for a 15 year old and for some reason I just like can't let it go so that is the first item in my project I am over a third of the way done but I still have a lot of product to go through next we have the forever sunshine body lotion this is so old <laughs> this is the old packaging and I am about I only have about a third of the product left as you can see it still smells so good I love the smell of this Honestly, oh, it smells so good, but um, this is so old, so I just really need to move this out of my collection so I can start using all of my amazing body shop lotions that I have. Okay, next is another body shop, or not body shop, Bath and Body Works product. This is the Love and Sunshine Fragrance Mist, and I am about halfway done with this. Um, this is only a mini one. This is uh, three fluid ounces, and yeah. This one smells okay. Um, not my favorite scent, but I just want to use this up and get it out. I, I don't, I don't really use these body sprays that much anymore. I have quite a few of them left though from Bath and Body Works, but I'm more of a perfume gal now, <laughs> or a body shop body mist gal. So I'm gonna work on that. I actually have another one. <laughs> Another body Bath and Body Works product. This is the Fine Fragrance Mist in Pink Chiffon. And as you can see, I'm like, well, I don't know if you can see, but I'll put it up close up in. Um, I am almost done. I only have a little bit left. I'm right above the word fine the words fine fragrance mist. So this one um should be gone pretty soon. That is a full size. Next we have the First Aid Beauty Skin Rescue Deep Cleanser with Red Clay. And this one, let's see where, oh shoot, I still have a lot. This is basically full. I thought this was empty almost. Um, I've used this a couple times, like I guess probably like three times, um, but there's still a lot of product in here. So I'm currently working on um, a face wash. It's by Bare Minerals, um, but I only have like two or three uses left so as soon as I finish that I will be using this and I wash my face every time I take a shower okay um next we have the way hair care treatment mask I have never used this before um so this is for hair so I don't know how many uses are in here but this is never used so yeah 
I really want to use it though. I got this in an Ipsy bag and I've heard good things so I want to move that out because I have quite a few hair masks that I need to, need to try. Next I have the Skin Fix It's What We Do Fragrance Free Ultra Rich Hand Cream. I've used this maybe once. This is practically full. And this is it's clinically proven to help treat dry, cracked skin on hands. So this is just a, just a little mini size, but I do want to use that up. I have so many lotions and hand lotions and body lotions and body butters and <laughs> it's crazy. Next we have the Nutri Seduction, Nutrition Nutri Seduction Pure Veil. This is a... Um, heat protectant spray. This smells so freaking good and I do have a mark on here but I'm actually below that. So yeah I still have quite a few uses in this left. This was quite expensive if I recall correctly but it smells real good. Whoa, I got that in my eyeballs. Okay we're fine. It smells really good. This is my only heat protection that I have, but this is really old. This I bought this when, or maybe my mom bought it for me, but this is when I got my, like, I think I got my bangs cut, like a side thing. Or did I get my hair cut really short? I don't know. This was, again, when I was in high school, like probably a freshman in high school. So this is really old. So I want to finish that up because I remember it being really expensive. And I have started using heat on my hair again, so I need to continue to use my heat protectant. Next, I have the Lush, the Soft Touch Body Butter. This is um, like a block of body butter and um you can see there's like maybe i don't know i'll show in the close-up there's like a curve in it because i plop it on my arm and like rub it on my arm and this smells so good i love the smell of this i don't know what it smells like <laughs> and i'm bad at describing scents but it smells delicious so oh handmade fresh from the kitchen so maybe this was like a kitchen product like a limited edition product I'm not sure oh relaxing lavender yeah I smell some lavender in there so yeah this is an amazing product it's just getting kind of old it was made July uh, 1st 2016 so I want to finish this up before it goes bad I'm not sure how long this lasts it says it's self-preserving so I'm assuming it's still good. It still smells good and feels good and the consistency is the same. So I'm going to try to use up as much of that as I can. And then the last like item per se that I have are all of these makeup samples. These are all of the makeup samples like in packets that I have left. I do have some skincare ones that are in my skincare drawer, but those are fine where they are, but these, I use those actually, but these I never ever use. So I'm going to try to use up as many of these as possible. I've got some It Cosmetics CC Creams, Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation, some primers, um, some little YSL lip sample things, and yeah, some Becca primers. So. I want to use up as many of these as possible and yeah that's everything that I have in my basket as I use things up I will save them and um, show that I won't put them in my empties videos I'll put them in my like my project progress videos so I'll update you on my empties from this specific basket um, anything that I mention in my project progress videos will be mentioned in my project progress videos again once they are empty so yeah that's everything that I have I hope you all enjoyed this video um sorry one second okay I hope you all enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you aren't already I hope you all have an amazing day and I will see you all in the next one bye